What does it mean when you have dense breasts? This is a term that you may have um, heard from your OBGYN or your primary care doctor, or you may have even read it on a mammogram report. Um, when patients see this term, they are thinking, am I at increased risk of getting breast cancer or do I need to do something special next year, something extra? These are the questions patients ask me and so I wanna unpack that for you. Breasts are made of two different types of tissue. One is glandular tissue and one is fatty tissue. And as we age, the glandular tissue gets replaced by fatty tissue. But when you're young, and by young I mean 30s, 40s, 50s, even 60s, um, the mammogram may have a hard time really piercing through and looking through this dense tissue, this glandular tissue, to say for sure that you don't have anything to worry about. No calcifications, no masses. And so you'll see that line in a mammogram that your breasts are very dense, and so this may reduce the accuracy of a mammogram. So the recommendation is to do a 3D mammogram or tomosynthesis. If you see that term, that's what it means. And um, a 3D mammogram is just a more advanced mammogram that takes different views of the breasts to really reconstruct a 3D um, visualization to really be able to look through all quadrants of the breast and give you a good report. And so if you have um, dense breasts, the takeaway point is that you need a 3D mammogram. Hope this was helpful.